And a warm welcome. Our venue for this game is the Emirates Stadium in North London. And Derek Ray joined here on the commentary box by Lee Dixon. And we have group stage action from the Cup coming up for you. It's Arsenal and they face Slavia Prague. Yeah, Derek, thanks. You can't really go on and win tournaments unless you're consistent in the group stages. Very important you don't drop points. Looking forward to this one. And this is the Arsenal starting 11. Bernd Leno is the goalkeeper. Danny Ceballos plays with Thomas Partey in central midfield. And the starting striker today is Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. Plenty of options. What can he do from here? Well, a good tackle. You have to think, Lee, Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang's natural goal-scoring presence could make a difference here. Well, basically, you've got to keep him out of the box because he's got such a brilliant finishing ability that you give him half a yard... He... And the goalkeeper covered a lot of ground to push that away from danger. High pressing at its best. Olayinka. Tomasz Holesz. You can sense the threat is there. And just like that, they've lost possession. And the press is on. Well, he went strongly into the challenge, and the result is a throw-in. Arsenal being afforded too much room. Looking for that final pass, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. And they have possession again. Might be able to produce from this position. And options in the centre. Needs to clear it away. That's what you call defending from the front. Possibilities here. David Luiz. It's with Gabriel. Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. Dorley. Excellent ball over the top. He knew he had to make the tackle and did. Pierre Emerick Aubameyang pressing as a team. Dorley. Now let's see about the cross. Still possibilities. Danger averted for now. Well, I just wonder to myself how important that save will be come the end of the game. Really important goalkeeping to keep it all square, wasn't it? He's managed to lose his marker. Now well, doesn't get away with it. Free kick given. Well, it's always at the discretion of the referee, in this case opting not to book him. The free kick from distance just off target. Well, I wasn't expecting that. I'm pretty sure the goalkeeper wasn't as well. It was close. Arsenal completely controlling possession, but the rest needs work. It's too slow moving the ball. There's no imagination. Need a lot more from them. Moving forward effectively. And there it is. The opening goal. 1-0. And they'll feel they deserve it. Well, Derek, as we see here, this is why I wasn't a forward. He passes this ball into net, uses all that finesse he's got. I just didn't have it. I had to put my laces straight through that ball, but what a finish. Well, the coach has to be happy with that. Got their noses in front. Still work to be done, though. And underway again. Arsenal, other side in front.
And just one minute of time added on for stoppages. Not the pass he had in mind. And with that, the first half draws to a close. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Nikolai Stanchiu. Good looking ball. Crossing into the middle. Cleared away. Martin Odegaard. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Can they keep it going? It's theirs to lose now. Well, let's see the replay and look at the pace at which the counter-attack happens. And he chooses to use power in the finish. Not much chance for the keeper when it's hit that hard. It's going their way. 2-0. Thomas excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward Arsenal could be on to something and Aubameyang in the centre pretty comfortable piece of defending well he didn't miss by an awful lot now they're going to alter things here's the substitution Really good reading of the game to win possession back. Alert defending. Provod. Traore. Good pass. And the cross smuggled away. Nicola Pepe. Pepe. He has time to play it over. Insufficient accuracy with the header lead. Yeah, he got there as well. It was all about could he get it on target, but when you see how far he missed, wow. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. Oscar Dorley. And the cross is very much on. Perfect challenge. Well, Arsenal have had total domination as far as possession is concerned. It's important to have strong, dominant players in your midfield, and they've got that. Just look at what that control gives you. Almost weighing up the opposition with a string of neat passes. Martin Odegaard. A potential danger. David Luiz using his physical strength to shield it. Danny Ceballos. And a long way out. Every goalkeeper would expect to catch that one. Dorley. It's with Erdogan, and they have possession again. And well, they couldn't keep possession. Just ten minutes to go. And Arsenal now find themselves in potentially a dangerous position. Obama Yang! And a goal to settle the issue once and for all.
Well, here's the replay. It's a very neat piece of deception to get past the defender. And then through on goal. Do you go for placement or do you go for power? Well, he certainly wasn't messing around, was he? Absolutely smashes it past the keeper. It's a really lovely finish. Well, his players have followed his every command and some. The coach must be delighted. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. And it's a case of just five minutes left. Oh, surely. He can't hold on to it. Oh, is he going to be punished here? He takes aim. Good defending to prevent the chance. And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. David Luiz could be in trouble here. And he takes it away. And it will be an Arsenal free kick. And that's it for tonight, full time, and an encouraging start for them. Three points from their initial fixture lead. Well, it's everything you want from the start of match one. Good, strong start. That result will give everybody confidence, especially the players. Well done. So, fruitful as far as Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang is concerned. Lee, how would you sum up his performance? Well, clearly the difference between the two sides today. Two goals, a really good performance, ran into the channel, did everything right. Absolutely, 9 out of 10.